Tyrone, today I make the easiest decision of my life. I choose to marry you. It's not because you have big muscles and it's not because of your handiness, but because you make me think bigger to have an open mind and to always see the bigger picture. You support everything I do, even if I only tell you half the story and expect you to read my mind. You make the best dad to our fur children and always continue to work so hard to give us everything that we need. I promise to encourage and support all of your dreams and hobbies, even if it does mean our house is decorated in deer antlers and cars. <laughs> I promise to always go on new adventures with you and the fur babies, even if it does mean 5am wake ups on Sundays. I promise to stand with you through the good times and the challenging times, to always make you feel safe and seen, to love you and to grow with you and to always give you all of me. You are my best friend and I'll always love you to the moon and back. <laughs> Oh, wow. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, don't do that to me. Wow, stunning. Absolutely stunning. Call me dad. Katie, I'm a very lucky man to be standing here in front of you today. Love everything about you, your infectious laugh, your smile, your urgent need to get in your pyjamas. <laughs> your loving, caring spirit shines through. You wear your heart in your sleeve, but you have another side of you that you can't help but respect and love. I'm very grateful to you that you put up with my craziness and not be able to sit still. But even more grateful that you agreed to marry me. As we move forward with life, I promise to support you and do anything I can to make your dreams a reality. Cheers! Cheers! <laughs> Hello everyone. First of all, first thing off the bat, Katie and the bridesmaids, don't they look beautiful? Yeah. It bodes well for me that one of them is my wife. And the groom, groomsman, looking quite dapper I might say. Okay, for those that don't know me, I'm Steve. I've been friends with Tyrone since about year 12 of high school. I still, I still remember when I first saw him. Jesus, that that sounds like it should be our wedding. Yeah.